I don't even know. Richest T. He's going to be fouling and blocking with mighty blow. Two mighty blows. Dirty player. Record isn't too hot at least. Mino in Nafstal. I would never use Nafstal Chaos though, but yeah. My Camry V friends, yeah, almost works, maybe, yeah. Dirty player. <laughs> I guess it could be worse, couldn't it? It's still going to be a struggle if we lose the toss. And he's still going to have a wizard to, to fucking attrition or fucking, you know, give him a shot. Need to remove some players. <laughs> Which is always asking a lot, isn't it? Bribe and hack and slash. He'll scum the wizard as well, of course he will. The dirty dingo. Maybe he won't? No, he doesn't. Yeah, set there could have been better than a bribe and hack and slash, I think. <laughs> Definitely no fouls this game. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, Wizard and Setter could have been a good show, wouldn't it? Can't blame people scumming stuff when they're down TV like that, though. I can bribe us to count with the pommy, yeah. <laughs> another bash team, another lost coin toss. Got eleven men, just gonna get banged on with mighty blow and stuff. We really need to win the toss and uh, make some cas, but instead, just gonna get fucked. Probably just gonna lose now actually. Start the next half with like eight players, seven or eight players. Against a wizard. Probably just gonna be a loss. Wish I hadn't played any games today. <laughs> At least we've got the Brets. Yeah, 
that's a good point, gain skills only. Thank you. Squirrel dude. VIP scroll, dude. Oh. He's got two mighty blow, which is enough. No, you can't. Lemon is good, no. Should have got some in the last game. He had... He had... <laughs> it was Claw and... Uh, he had Claw and Hobgoblins. He's, here we've got Claw and Skeletons. But yeah, at least it's 75% knockdowns for the most part. Instead of 55%. But still just rolled a million pushes. Should have looked at the block dice on the last game, actually. The problem with the gain skills is I'm not exactly sure which are the blitz rods. Is it these two? Yeah. And these are both throw rods. Oh wow. Movement seven, edge three. What a beast. God, kick back from hack and slash would be outstanding. Yeah, no one even dead. Pretty insane start. Looks like he goes to the Dodd School of LOS blocks. Uh, <laughs> deciding to save that mighty blow for later. He's made of blots. Yeah, backyard door door. <laughs> Basically, I'm just gonna go for the blitz here, even though it exposes him. Fuck it, I don't. I just don't really care that much. Um, it's just because cyanide are lazy, <laughs> and they were like, let's just make. Um, Let's just not bother making models for the for the star players, basically. Make a blots. I can't even new hinny. Why did he fucking go up the box? I don't understand. Maybe that's 
because he's got a thing. That was a good blot. <laughs> it's been a matter. <laughs> Yeah, regen. Motherfucker. Would have been good to have killed the Tomb Guardian straight away. Men at while kicking. <laughs> yeah. You know there's some kind of crazy, like, five men dying in one turn thing coming up here. It can't start this well. Panic attrition fireball. <laughs> Did it even need claw? I don't know, I didn't look at the, I never really look at the uh, dice lock, to be honest. Seven, yeah, needed claw and mighty blow. Yeah, TG seven DK is is horrific, absolutely fucking horrific. Kills the team, doesn't it? As a as a fun choice, really. Off on this. Yeah, maybe you should pray for burn for five balls. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, I'm told. The, the problem was, I'll tell you, I'll tell you exactly what happened with Kemri Kem getting nerfed like this. Um, what happened was, the Blood Bowl Rules Commission, the mighty Blood Bowl Rules Commission cleverest guys in Blood Bowl, professional games designers, apparently, is, is the title that they've bestowed upon themselves. Um, they thought, when they nerfed the fuck out of fouling in the CRP rulebook, oh my god, ball down and no balls and he got a Kaz off it, are you serious? <laughs> He's dead. Oh fuck, well I can, I can buy three more beast men, so... Fuck's sake, man. There's no need for people to do shit like that and get rewarded. No fucking need, is there? Fucking tea. Oh, man. Why would you even take the board down and no balls there? You got three re-rolls. Why would you even do that? Didn't have much of a choice there, did I? No, I probably moved in the wrong square.
can't believe he took that. <laughs> can't believe he took that board down. <laughs> Fucking hell. Yeah, no, I'm obviously that was my first first instinct was to do that. The only danger is if you don't if you don't seventy five percent and he sidestep and gets to block you with with a chainsaw, doesn't he? Probably should could have got the uh, probably could have got the movement guy to there. Actually, would have been better. But never mind. He's still in some trouble, isn't he? Even if he gets to go down the sideline here. Yeah, sidestep, yeah, that's the thing. That is the danger of the bits in the saw. There's just no point in the decay skill, really, backyard dodo. Anyway, as I, as I was getting before, my line of thought was interrupted by the uh, both down and no balls. Um, the point of the Tomb Guardians was the BBRC thought that they had buffed fouling because they were that fucking stupid that they hadn't realised that they'd nerfed it. That's how fucking dumb they were, right? So, yeah, obviously once you've nerfed fouling, they thought they'd buffed fouling, so they thought, oh, we have to nerf Kemri. So they took away Mighty Blow from the, from the mummies and uh, gave them fucking decay as well. Yeah, I don't mind decay and rotters, but there's just no need for a skill. They made a new skill for rotters and tomb, and tomb guardians, and they just didn't need to, did they? They thought the current rules for fouling, or they, they thought they'd buffed fouling, that's what they thought they'd done, yeah. They thought plus one <laughs> is better than plus two, just because there's, there's slightly less chance of getting sent off. Slightly less chance, sometimes, of getting sent off. I guess it's got to be a handoff, right? Team making the plays with his hair. Uh, with his fucking... Making the plays with his uh, things. Kemri men's. They gain one movement, losing my Eblo and got and got decay. The actual change they made to fouling was they made dirty player plus plus one instead of plus two, and they made it you get sent off on a one third chance instead of a one in six or a one in two. And they and and what's it called? They removed the horrific old rules for get the ref. So they just they completely neutered fouling and thought they buffed it. That's why when Dode wants to fucking put the BBIC on a pedestal, I tell him to fuck off every time. Right, he's almost he's almost uh, protected there, hasn't he? Somehow. Could dodge double GFI three, four, five double GFI, and then into another two D as well. I'd rather not have to dodge the Odiner. I'd rather be able to block, block this Tomb Guardian down and get straight to him. So how could I do that? Stop that, get two assists in. Three, four, five, six. Has he got a GFI to get in there? Yeah, he does. That's clearly the better play though, isn't it? Oh, there's a guy there. So we go there. Go there. Go there, yeah, this is no. Well, he can go here, actually. And the guard can come in, that's even better, isn't it? And if it's a pal, it's happy days. What safe move can we make this one? Is a pal. A bander. It's a shame that that blocks his path to come in because I'd obviously rather blitz, even though he has, even though the wrestle doesn't matter. I'd rather blitz with him for the easier recovery. 
from Best for Gore, but never mind. <laughs> Classic. Classic. No. Oh. I'll, I'll let him off because he's best for goal. <laughs> he catches it. <laughs> Glorious. I should have put the guard in there, shouldn't I, so he could have one dice him. Look it, hopefully it's not a boat down. Maybe the uh, rest of the strength guy should have been there. Don't know. <laughs> no, J5, I didn't keep my removed toenails in the jail. Chaos 12 team without claw happened, yeah. Not even planning on, yeah. Anything could have. The first turn was a fireball, wasn't it? Then it was like a dirty player foul. And then just like a random mighty blow block. It was, th was three deaths in three turns. I thought he'd have bolted then. I'm glad he didn't, mate. But I thought he would have done. Reroll gone, kick back imminent. <laughs> Fuck head. <laughs> oh man. Oh fuck off. Oh there you go. You can get your Andy Davo emotes out there. <laughs> Fucking T. That's why he didn't bolt. He knew he wouldn't need to. Oh god. Fuck's sake. Good choice there. Good choice to uphill block with your reroll gone. <laughs> he might be tightening to me but I've got a mirror <laughs> the Andy Devo emotes is, is two two pals two red dice pals oh well that was okay there was his two four pluses but it got him cold instead of got him the ball Obviously, I want to surf him, even though the sheet says not to. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, 
That's the difference. Nope. Good job I didn't re-roll it though, eh? <laughs> good, good no re-roll there. <laughs> well, that was nuts, wasn't it? That was pretty fucking nuts, to be fair. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> um, if he blitzes. Oh no, because there's nobody there. Alright, he's not in a tackle zone, so he can just pick it up. I should need to do this to get to get him occupied. <laughs> right, no surfs. Okay, yeah, I've got I've got it this time. Got it this time. Six dice at that guy to surf him. Six fucking dice. <laughs> what even is this shit? Now he just dodges away and scores or what? Oh man. Fuck's sake. I guess I should have gone for the pickup. But I, I needed him to him to base that other Tomb Guardian. I fucking had to go for that. He's unsurfable. <laughs> He's just fucking unsurfable. What a piece of shit. Alright. It's making a relevant block first. <laughs> this is pretty tricky, isn't it? Because I obviously want to get two dice on him and two dice on him, but I can't. I guess one dice on him is better, but then I, I wanna, don't want to get surfed back. So this has to be a one dice. Move two players in. Blitz, pick up. Can't stand him up, so I have to, I have to have to blitz with him. So this has to be a one dice block. Oh yeah. Get the loner in there. Oh, he's dead. He was badly hurt and dead. So he got fucked by, uh, he got fucked by, what's it called? That, that skill that Tomb Guardians have. I don't know one dice blocks, I need the rerolls for the GFIs. Dead. 
<laughs> it has been pretty entertaining, to be fair, yeah. <laughs> He's rolled some horrible dice, hasn't he? He's, oh, God. <laughs> to be fair. <laughs> Although he got that uphill, that uphill double pow. <laughs> Aside from that, his dice have been absolutely fucking horrific. Okay, so he wants to be there as a scoring threat, doesn't he? I guess I'd rather just hand off to him. Hmm. Right, fuck it, let's make this block first. Good, no surf. Just the way I like it. Like, getting three star play points on the claw guy would actually be good. So I don't hate it. Put him an MVP away from, from leveling. Oh, also, he's got the wizard, hasn't he? So actually, this works out great just to GFI twice. Blue packet. Bosh. So now if he bolts either, if he bolts him, the other one can score anyway. Maybe I should have gone for the handoff. This turn with a reroll. Hmm. That would have been better, wouldn't it, than a GFI? I had to make three GFIs, didn't I? So it didn't matter. I had to make three GFIs to score. But I guess after making them without rerolling, maybe I should have gone for the handoff with a reroll. And then a pick up. What, what's better? Handoff with a reroll is one in nine. When the pick up's one in twenty seven, whereas the GFI is one in thirty six. So it actually it would have been slightly more risky, but it would have levelled him to frenzy. Probably worth it. Make a three dice. My fault if I've got to re-roll it and fail the GFI now. <laughs> yeah, I can't hand off now. Because that would be one in nine to fail. But yeah, maybe I should have handed off then. <laughs> yeah, Triparis. Um, they're not actually underdeveloped, it's just everyone died. Unbelievably not making a trip by yeah. Oh, wow. Great KO rolls. Oh, glorious. Actually, one of his didn't matter because he wasn't going to get sent off anyway. Or he might have used his bribe if he hadn't been killed. So, we've got 10. He's got the wizard still, though. 10 versus 10. Pretty good. Yeah, the, the thing is, lemon is good. The thing is... As somebody said, I've been using human cheerleaders for the 17 game unbeaten run. I was going to change them in the midst of that. And it's like, but 
but you've been using the cheerleaders till now, the human cheerleaders now and what if you change them I was like yeah I can't I can't actually afford to change them can I um, okay this guy carries I guess no, no, he can't he's got a block this guy carries and it's not the end of the world if he gets bolted Actually got the maximized blocks over now with block. With block and against shitheads. Yeah, two dead. Chaos Warrior missed next game. Killer minus movement. <laughs> just to just random, random team. Okay, I've got to go for the pickup with two hands, haven't I? Now. But first, somebody punch somebody. Really want to actually blitz him. So I guess it's a block without a block. Ugh, dirty dingo. Should have put him two in front so I could try to hand off to him this turn. I guess I can try to hand off to him next turn. And I'm watching Lupac stream. <laughs> Maximize blocks block against shitheads. Yeah, when I said shitheads, I meant Armour 7 guys, didn't I? Is what I meant because, you know, it was a good chance to uh, to stun them. And open up more space for subsequent turns. Like if they're dwarves or whatever, then maybe you don't wanna like if you haven't got block you don't wanna make I, I often with, with rookie chaos I don't wanna make too many blocks because the risks of the one in nine is annoying, isn't it? But when you got blocks and you play an armor seven guys should probably go for it. Yeah, it's got to be pretty salty. He's been horrifically unlucky with it, with the quad skulls and one eighty one and <laughs> yeah, he's been he's been really unlucky with his uh, with his blocks for sure. I just got a little bit salty when he uphill double power. <laughs> J five, <laughs> pretty good.
can't really complain about standing those guys up and getting them stunned. Though, can can't actually get the hit on there, can I? Unless I uh, pow this guy and then get an assist in and hit him that way. So, ball's safe. Don't even have to score again. So this is just a fine block to take. Okay. Bit risque, but have to go for it. Well, I don't have to. I want to go for it. <laughs> Had to try. Go for the handoff now. Unbelievable, Jeff. <laughs> I went back to the max. Yeah, he's had he's had horrible luck. Flat foot gets panning on yeah. Pow on. Seven mighty blow, thanks. Thanks for standing him up. Can bl blots him, can I? Seven mighty blow. I could block him and blitz somebody else. God, that's exciting. I still want to hit and run, though, I think. I think it's still better just to hit and run. Well, I could have, could have maximized blocks. Can hit him there, can't he? No, if he goes there, it's harder. Should I go for a pass here? I mean, he's, he's okay to eat the ball, though, isn't he? At the end of the day.
Yeah, the thing is, he's going to eat the bolt, though, isn't he? That's the thing at the moment. He's eating the bolt, so I'd quite like to pass to somebody else so that he gets it and won't get bolted as well. Maybe pass to that rookie. Get the rookie back to pass to. Oh, he's fireball anyway. Nice hit. <laughs> <laughs> All right, he's just going to score now then. <laughs> nah, it's not about wasting star player points. I really don't mind just scoring on people for sure rather than maybe making a pass. <laughs> Looking good. This is this is made up for the look of the last game, hasn't it, really? like Pretty much. He's been unbelievable. Unlucky. <laughs> oh fuck! Oh, I'm too late. But um, I wish I could have just said that to him. Should have done that turn one. Fucking hell! That's genius. All right. Uh, well, that makes things a lot easier now, doesn't it? Can I bez forward? Can foul this guy, I think. No, nah, I don't want to foul. Just get sent off. Do nothing. It's a random fuckhead. Happy to manic. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, free. Yeah, look, 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 yeah. Yeah, that was amazing, yeah. He said he said look look look. That's what it was. Somebody some other random guy said look look look. So I said look look look. Yeah, that's right. Oh my god. <laughs> two two quads. Two quads. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, poor T. He's been horrifically unlucky. I mean, now it's gone past. Now it's gone past unlucky to just... <laughs> completely ridiculous now. Might be saving his first that I'm doing. Oh baby. At least his regens have mostly worked. <laughs> I know there's no real need for a cage, but it's just protecting the better players, isn't it? 
How unlucky can you get? Yeah. Greet that shit, yo. Come on, get a Kazlona guy. Oh, playing like a shit they're rewarded. <laughs> Glorious. Greed is good. Greed is right. Greed works. <laughs> Yeah, that's true, Oriolensis. Yeah, that's true. But, I mean, he has been obviously completely robbed of any chance by the dice. Um, though, funnily enough, I thought he should have taken the... Uh, I thought he should have re-rolled that first boat down. That he conserved his re-rolls, because he knew he was going to roll out all them quads. Um, but, yeah, I mean, the quads and the other thing. And, and he got lucky with the uphill powers on the dice carrier, on the ball carrier, obviously. But the other stuff is... He's, he's had unbelievably bad luck. Absolutely ridiculous. Ah, oh, thank you very much, Oriolensis. Ah, oh, that's great. That's great. Glorious. Because I thought it was a bit shit that you would have to delete the Bretts or whatever, whereas if they were both first you could choose. was a bit shit. That's cool that you can choose for sure. Thanks for the update. Yeah, I was thinking that. I was actually thinking, yeah, flat fart. Well, not flat fart. I was thinking alpha go actually. I was thinking alpha go, but is flat fart on, on even higher? God, he is. Oh God, if he gets the touchdown and then pass to him as well, holy shit! All right, let's go then. No cars feels bad, man. Um, I mean, the ball's pretty safe, isn't it? I could go for this pass. Fucking get in. <laughs> lads, lads, boys, lads, boys, lads. Outrageous. Can he reach the ball here? Mm, not really. It'd be a six plus dodge. Actually, I should have fouled with a with a ball carrier, shouldn't I? That was a bit of a stupid, uh, bit of a stupid one, bit of a dumb one there. <laughs> Does Christopher not require sleep? Well, also if you look at not only if you look at how many games Christopher's played, if you also look at the percentage of his games, victories that were concessions, particularly the Nurgle team. You can see that he doesn't. He, he actually has time to sleep when you realise how many of the wins are by concession. So, uh, yeah, I'm sure he does sleep. <laughs> right, so ball carrier foul next turn. Um, not loan a foul. Right, come on, Kaz here, that would be glorious. Oh man! Genius! <gasps> Genius! Oh god. Didn't even see what it was, just badly hurt. 
Fucking hell, flat fired. What a fucking, what a fucking game. Leveled them both. Appears to be greedy sometimes, eh? Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> what a lucky bastard. <laughs> yes, thank you, Lemon is good. Yeah. That is what a turnaround from the last game, yeah. Fucking hell. The last game was like fully depressing. Everyone dying and this game is just like every exactly the opposite. This is easier this far, isn't it? Can you base the ball? Herp derp, base, base, base. So this will make it harder. And you also can't surf him, can you? Try and get the ball carrier sent off. Ugh. God damn it, best for goal. <laughs> Has he made salty VM? I wouldn't be surprised. I mean, to be fair, he's been... <laughs> Oh, he's been her even with claw and everything and and all of the uh, you know all of the what's it called uh, all of the uh, snowball effect. He's been horrifically unlucky. Two, obviously, two quad skulls, the, the one in eighty ones as well. I think he's made two one in eighty ones. Failed dodges into Kaz and stuff. It's been outrageous. He's been proper, proper unlucky. God, level and flat fart there was genius. Holy shit. He's laughing. All right, that's okay. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> no, really. Yeah, he got banged on. <laughs> that's great I mean they are made of paper aren't they when people have claw that's why it's so stupid because because they're designed around being armor 9 but you can completely bypass it so it's just fucking stupid isn't it That it's actually a goblin has more survivability against my team okay no he's got stunning a slam catcher has more survivability no that's the same a gutter runner has more survivability than a tomb guardian, which is just fucking dumb, isn't it? Basically, it's basically fucking dumb. <laughs> it did take me three tries to name an AV7 with Dutch, it did, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I had good dice, now I can die peacefully, yeah. <laughs> yep. Fox, plus strength, I'd take plus strength, to be fair. I, I'd take plus strength, but, um,. Yeah, panning on, obviously, if it's, uh... Like, there's an argument we've made for tackle, to be fair. But, um, double would be panning on. So he doesn't have jump up. He doesn't have panning on already. So, no. I'd dodge. I would take dodge over jump up. Because he ain't got panning on yet. But I wouldn't take dodge. I'd take panning on. <laughs> 
I wouldn't even consider strengths done for a good piling on. Guard guy on LOS over the plus strength guy? Yeah, man, the guard guy. He's just guard. Mighty blow, isn't he? It's not that but good. I wouldn't mind that beastman dying, to be fair. Strength guy, he's gonna is he gonna do a friendly foul on the loner? No, that's nice of him, isn't it? Yeah, plus strength to get frenzy. Yeah, uh, so he's he's no longer a overcosted piece of shit, <laughs> and and obviously with the frenzy dying before, it works out not even that bad that the frenzy guy died, and got some money for replacements. Twenty AV break. Oh, 50 for Elfago. Holy shit, he's so close. He's so close. Only five armor breaks. That was That's a glorious <laughs> Dead MVP. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Fucking Blood Bowl is shit, isn't it? Blood Bowl is always shit for one person. Fucking L12 for a Chaos Warrior in one game. That's pretty fucking good, isn't it? Holy shit. Hardly broke AV. Dodge, the dodge worked, the GFIs worked, the pickups worked, the pass worked, three catches worked. <laughs> what the fuck? No fireball worked. Unbelievable. This is probably the luckiest I've been and the unluckiest my opponent's been, to be fair. It was crazy. What, what, did, what did he get? He got... You got a double skull, uh, both down, re-rolled into a both down. Wow, look at that. Fucking hell. 19 compared... 19 skulls compared to 13 things. And even the both downs usually weren't good for him. So there's a, there was a one in eight... Oh, they're different blocks. They're different blocks. What the egg? That's one he, one he accepted. One he re-rolled. And then a double skull. <laughs> that he rolled, he rolled into double skull because it doesn't come up. And the both down... That was re-rolled into both down, skull both down, and then the another cut skull. It's a shit that they don't turn up on the things, but yeah, his dice were, his dice were completely, completely, fucking ridiculous, completely ridiculous. But um, there you go. I almost feel bad because he is quite a nice guy, isn't he, Richard's T? But uh, you know. It's him or me at the end of the day, so I'm happy it was him. <laughs> Out of, oh yeah, his chainsaw kicked back as well, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> More skulls and pushes, crazy. It was it was crazy dice that. That was really fucking crazy. <laughs> I'm glad TLC. Right, let's have a look. Let's get a piling on. Or plus strength. I wouldn't mind plus strength. No, oh, plus movement, no. <laughs> nah. Nah, mate. You can keep your plus movement and I can pile on. Movement on him would be interesting. Because then he could uh he could cover the width of the pitch, couldn't he? I guess it's going to be Frenzy because I don't have one anymore. And Wrestle Frenzy's alright. And Strength 4 Frenzy's good. So I guess it's an easy, easy pick. 10 players for the next match. BLGF muted Fago. I guess I can keep him for now. So buy two. Two more Beastmen. I have 12 for the next game. And see what happens. Maybe he's not by anyone yet, actually, because see if see if we're top chaos and see how what the points shake out as. 
Um, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.